afternoon, everyone, and thank you for joining me today. I'm Jenny Montgomery. Welcome to another half hour of information to help you make the most of your time to make informed decisions and to keep up with goings on around Greater Augusta. We've got fun ideas for your kids this summer, boating safety, and a fun and fresh look at marriage with a couple you may know. Dave and Ashley Willis have become some of America's most trusted voices on issues related to marriage. Many of you knew them through Stevens Creek Community Church in Augusta. They've since relocated to Texas as part of the Marriage Today team where their books, blogs, videos, Naked Marriage podcast, and live events reach millions of couples around the world. And now they're bringing a one night only date night experience to the Miller Theater in downtown Augusta thanks to our friends at 88.3 WAFJ radio station. I'm the cuddler in the family, and he so whenever is, I get is. close to Ashley, like, I want to just throw my leg on her. I just want to wrap her up in this cocoon of love. He does. And just, like, hold her tight, and I, I have cuddle needs. In fact, out in the XO shop, there's a shirt that says Extreme Cuddler, and it was only for women, which I was deeply offended by. Because he was offended. That's, yes. that's, that's my, my love language. It's true. Okay, how many of you are, are non-cuddlers? Raise your hands high, because I'm a non-cuddler. And it's, I know you're resistant. It's okay. We can admit this. We can admit this. No, God okay. rarely puts two cuddlers in the same marriage because they wouldn't do anything else. You'd get nothing That's done. True. That's true. And so. But it's not that I don't. I love, I love to cuddle with Dave in small doses. But when I go to bed. You are such a liar. Like, okay. In front of all these people. <laughs> in front of God. And all these simulcasts. It is always a pleasure to welcome WAFJ station manager Steve Swanson to the show. Steve, I wish we could just keep watching them. They are so much fun. I'm telling you what, <laughs> if you're looking for some encouragement and inspiration, it's That's, a great place to find it. Okay, so I have to say, I loved Ashley in that clip because I, I am the non-cuddler okay. in the bunch. I'm the non-cuddler. I'm like Ashley. Yes, I like it, but when, when I go to sleep, mm, Go. Space, go. please. Got it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And my husband would be the one, like, just wrap his leg around when he says the thing about he's so offended because Extreme Cuddler was only in the women's design t shirts. I'm telling you. <laughs> that's Dave, though. He's got a great sense of humor. And yep. they're a believable couple because they're transparent about their relationship. Right. And they've managed to just touch so many people's lives. We're excited to have them come back here to Augusta. Well, it's a unique event. It's one night only. That's it's right. coming up Saturday night. Mm -hmm. uh, two hours combining the best of, you know, their hilarious marriage stories, but also important biblical teaching about marriage. That's right. And that's something that we all need. And whether, you, whether you've been married a short time or a long time, like some of us older couples, mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, you need to take the time to refresh your relationship and to be intentional about it. And that's one of the first things that kind of falls by the wayside. My little sister's so done a very true. smart thing in her calendar. She takes a Sharpie and marks out the square. So if she's asked to do something else, she can say, I'm sorry, I'm already committed for that night. That's her night with her husband. And that's how much um, in emphasis she places on it. That's exactly she's right. She's not gonna budge. That's yeah. exactly right. So it's intentionality. And I'm guessing, I'm guessing, Jenny, there are people watching right now that could use a little refreshment for their marriage. Don't you know it. It gets a little yep. stale doing the same old thing, you know, hey, let's go mm -hmm. by and get a DVD, make some popcorn, hey, we had a date night, it's covered. And there's so much more to that relationship. You didn't just fall in love with that person by chance or by accident, you were intentional about it. Be intentional about feeding and maintaining and growing your relationship. You know, it's really funny too because it, so many couples in, in a situation like, like I have been in the last few years, all of a sudden, your kids are grown. That's right. They're out of college. They're out. And you're looking at this person and thinking, hmm. Who are you? Wow, we've got to get to know you all over again. I'm telling you, that, that's the truth because a lot of people do. don't think about. You, you, you wind up putting so much of your mm -hmm. relationship on hold. That's exactly while, right. While life happens and while, while, while you're focusing on your kids. That's absolutely right. So this is for married couples, again, whether they've been married a long time or a short time. It's an evening of encouragement, an evening of inspiration and an evening of laughter. And who couldn't mm -hmm. use more of all those three things? <laughs> certainly, certainly. We need all that. So it's coming up at the Miller Theater, mm -hmm. and tickets are 19 and $29, so it's extremely reasonably priced. Yes. You can get them at the Miller Theater box office or go to your website, WAFJ.com. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, we'd love to have folks join us. It's gonna be a special evening. You don't wanna miss it. It's one of those things, Sunday, somebody's gonna say, man, I had the best time last night. Sorry you missed it. You don't wanna miss it. You don't want to be the you one missing it. it. 
Right. Um, the Willises were just so popular when they were here in Augusta. Yes. Um, Ashley's blog has so many followers. Mm -hmm. And the Naked Marriage podcast is a, a great, great thing to listen to. It's a great resource. Uh, God has really used them as a couple to be marriage encouragers. And when they were at Stevens Creek, I'm a member there, uh, they were very popular in terms of their presentations. And it kind of grew, I think, far beyond what they expected. But the senior pastor there said, I always knew they'd have a larger platform. And now they're speaking at conferences that are being simulcast to 50, 60,000 people at a time. Right. And they're being heard around the world. They just have been given a gift of communication and a gift of encouragement that all marriages need. Isn't that interesting? So you don't think that it's necessarily you start out with this goal in mind. It's just the strength of your relationship leads you to that. Well, they started a Facebook page dealing with marriage, and now it has over one million people. It started with a them. Facebook page. <laughs> I mean, they didn't expect that to grow like it has. That's always been an interest in, in their relationship to help other couples, to encourage other couples. Mm -hmm. And God has really used them as a couple to do that. And you get both unique perspectives of their transparent relationship. They have four boys, too. Uh, bless Ashley's I'm heart. Telling you, she just, lives in a house yeah. full of Y chromosomes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure she's asking why quite a bit. I'm sure she oh. is. Yeah, I'm sorry. I, I just couldn't pass that up. It's going to be a lot of fun. It really, really is. So don't think of it as something you're going to be dragging your spouse to. Think oh, no. of it as an evening where you can laugh together, learn together, be encouraged together. That's what it's about. And one of the things they'll be doing, they have a new book, mm -hmm. The Naked Marriage, and they're going to be having a live question and answer <laughs> session, and then they'll be signing mm -hmm. uh, signing copies of their book. That's right. That's right. I think it's terrific to have the question and answer session. I mean, you don't always get that when you go to something like this. No, that's true. And of course, they're taking a chance, Absolutely. let's face it, just, just doing it live and saying, okay, you know, we're open to questions, but they have the ability to think on their feet and respond accordingly. Again, because they've been so immersed in this particular area. They're based out of Dallas, Texas now, mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. a ministry called Marriage Today. They just were on a cruise, a marriage cruise in the Mediterranean, which sounds pretty good to me. I could, I could handle that, yeah. And they do right. these conferences called EXO conferences all across the country. And we're just fortunate to get them back here, even for a night. Certainly, certainly. I know that a lot of people look forward to seeing them, and we want to encourage you to, you know, right now, get on your computer and right. reserve your tickets. Take a look again at the details. The event is coming up this weekend, Saturday, June the 8th, at the Miller Theater. As Steve has said, it's one night only, 7 p.m. Tickets again, 19 or $29, and you can get them on wafj.com or the Miller Theater box office. I know that you are excited to have them here because I know, hello. I guess um, you want to mention the other book. This is another one, yes. I think someone's <laughs> telling us, hello, The Seven Laws of Love. That's right. This is Dave's book. What That's can right. you tell us about that? Well, it's it actually preceded uh, The Naked Marriage and it really opened the doors to a lot of opportunities for Dave. I remember hearing an interview with him on WGN in Chicago, wow. where this book had just opened that opportunity to him. So again, I think God has provided open doors for both of them, and it's been very popular. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. I know that strengthening families is an important part of your ministry with WAFJ. It is, it is. So this is something you have to be very excited about. Well, we, we are because we want to be more than music. We love playing great music. We're yeah. glad people love the music. We want to make an impact on families, deepen relationships, and encourage people to grow in those relationships because it makes for stronger families and a stronger community. I was going to say stronger community, yep. and that's what we all hope for. Steve Swanson, thank you so much for My your time. My pleasure, as always. And again, this Saturday night, date night, with David Ashley Next on J.